How's the year going? The word of God stands forever. Whether we pray it, whether we don't pray it, the mind of God is the mind of God. It stands sure. And unto the righteous, it is blessing. And unto the wicked, it is judgment. What have you chosen? It says, I've set it before you. Life and death. This year, God is doing a new thing. And I can assure you, the promises of God concerning it shall surely come to pass. In the name of Jesus. Until May 2007, when the love of God located Princess Odinaka Alfred, she had lived a full-time prostitute operating from a brothel in Suleja, a suburb of Abuja. By the prompting of the Spirit, we were led of Christ to recover Princess. My names are Princess Peace Odinaka Alfred. Before the Lord touched me, I used to be a prostitute there from Wawa to Suleja Barracks. And there I had a lot of bitter experiences about being a prostitute. But today, as you can see me, as the audience, as you can watch, who lit had been believed that my ashes would be turned into beauties, that I will go from grass to grace, that I will be a teacher to the whole world. I give all, all the glory. What he has done through the woman of God, Pastor Bingbe and Pastor Esther. Father, I give you all the glory for that. Praise the Lord. As a war, when I was in the barracks there, I experienced some bitter things that one should not even think about. The girls there, the prostitutes are in pain, especially those that went into this business because of frustration, because of wanting or the other, because they could not make the ends meet. Not those that went into it because of pleasure or because they want to acquire wealth. I, for instance, went into it because of frustration and I want to get some money to start one or two days. So there in the barracks or where we were hustling as we call it, a, a, a holy name to make it look uh, unique in the presence of people. As we are there I encountered some bitter experiences like a man who comes into one's room and the person will brush the condom to allow it but so that the person can transmit the diseases he has in him. As one that will come, the ritualists will patronize them then, they will come, they want to double the condom and take the outer one so that they can use what is inside the person. We went with her to pack her personal belongings from the brothel and then she bade goodbye to her colleagues. Yes, I'm here with my baby known here as a Rosemary and she has come to say goodbye to her words and then she's entering into new life to begin to affect her generation and I can tell you with the new leaf I have here the face of Christianity is going to experience explosion. What do I call it? Explosion. Pastor Esther, what do I call it? Explosion. Explosion. Girls, what do we call it? Explosion. Thank you very much. It's my business premises. Okay. I'm presiding at where they call it. Okay, so you own Mess Mess Ten. Yes, I'm okay. the owner of Mess Ten. And that's an a beer pillow and uh, beer pillow and yeah, chalets. Chalets. Yes. Okay. God bless you. Amen. What advice do you have for girls out there? Even even before Mary got to be a born again. If she will be a witness now, mm. I told them, those girls that are staying in my chalice, I told them that by January next year, I don't want to see any of them again. I want them to burn again, mm. even before she turned to over a new leaf now. Okay, so you are happy with this development? Totally. I already, before this event, I told them, didn't I tell them, that by January next year, I don't want to see any of them doing this job. So what advice? But personally, I am expecting one day I will sell all my buildings here and turn over a new leaf too. Yes. Yeah. So what advice do you have for her now that she turn again and she's... To face exactly. the word of God. Uh -huh. To face the word of God. And to so pray to those that have... To turn to Christ. Okay. As you have seen her today, do you see any change in her to convince you that she's really a changed person? Yes. I see changes in her that convince me that, it's a new, a new, that uh, she's really a new person now. Um, I have. I, I want to tell our government that they should make things very possible for people to change, to know God, and even the government also to know God, so that all of us will come together to know God and live all this uh, uh, useless life that we are living. Although even the government, there are, old, there are most of the people that are making us to doing all these odd businesses that we are doing, that we are not supposed to do, in order to meet up, to make the boat end meet. Personally, I'm not supposed to be in this business. 
But since I feel that I have nothing, I have no, I, 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 there's no alternative, and I have to be in the business. I'm not happy in the business. Okay. Now you have managed these girls. I mean, you have been aware. You are aware, You know what they do. Yes. And now, um, you know their problems. Yes. And uh, from Rosemary, I get to know many of them really love to leave the business, but they don't have a choice. What do you think are their limitations that if they get help in that area, it will help them to change? If, if I am to, if I'm to say something, to say the people that are, are supposed to point about this kind of uh, problem is for government. They are allowing things to be it doesn't have to happen. And they have been there trying their own possibility to make sure that uh, the, the nation is going in a good condition. Most of them will not find themselves here. And even those that are supposed to find themselves here, maybe they, they just want it for themselves. Then the churches are supposed to intervene. Understand me? But momently, I pose every question and every accusation on government. God bless you, sir. Amen. Okay. At this time where we stay, they have happy. Jenny, I'm going to miss you. I love you. Oh. Actually, we miss her. Her. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Actually, we miss we miss her, but oh. we will soon join yes, her. Amen. Because we love the way she. Thank God, say you no be ashanti. And thank God, say today you don't give your life to God. I'm going to miss you. Hey, I really miss all of you, honestly. You hey, see my baby friends there too. Oh, I'm going to miss them. Oh. I'm going to miss all of them. Oh. Hey, look at this one. That what says, advice do you have for, for Rosemary as she's going out? Okay, I, I wish her the best of her life. You, what do you do here? I'm working here. As who? She says that. Okay. And what advice do you have for other girls? I want other guests to repent as Auntie Mary repent. Amen. And I'll stop what they are doing. Amen. God bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Oh, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Let it be ever his mind. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Let the people rejoice. Who come to the Father through Jesus our Son. Over and again I give my life Over and again I give my soul Over and again and over again I belong to you, Lord Over and again I give my life Over and again I give my soul Over and again and over again I belong to you Teach me, Lord, I'm on my knees, if thou is any way. Teach me, Lord, everlasting, Lord, I belong to you, Lord. Teach me, Lord, I'm on my knees, if there is any way. Teach me, Lord, everlasting, Lord, I belong to you. Teach me, Lord, among my nails, if there is any way. Teach me, Lord, everlasting, Lord, I belong to you, Lord. Teach me, Lord, among my nails, if there is any way. Teach me, Lord, everlasting, Lord, I belong to you. Oh Lord, to you alone I tribute all the worthiness and praise unto your Father, King of Glory, I give. Praise the Lord. By my own experience and my testimony, that there is no investment that is greater than investing in the lives of those that are destitute of love. Join us as we unfold the acceptable religion of God as a tool for overcoming all evil. This is not another religious program. It is about love and overcoming evil with good. If you are willing and obedient, you will eat the good fruit of the land. For sponsorship and fellowship, contact Destiny.